Areas of central and eastern Kendall Land got their first taste of severe weather this season. People in the Mount Vernon area are without power after strong storms knock down electric poles. Kendall Land's Dan Santella is live in the area with a look at the damage. Dan. Hey, Angela, I'm behind the camera right now. We've been getting a lot of rain in this area, heavy winds, so I'm behind the camera and underneath the hatchback of our Kello car. I know just as I say that, the wind and, and rain dies down considerably, but Central Electric Cooperative uh, said they knew about more than 100 broken poles near Mount Vernon and Lomas from the storm uh, that hit the area early this morning. So the place the company directed me to to check out some of the damage is far off in the distance there. I couldn't quite get there because the road was blocked off. Over 100 poles down, and you can see with some of the water moving right there as I adjust the camera that the wind is still up right now. So I'm going to be talking with the company here at 5.30 and get an update from them on how the restoration has gone. This is near exit 325, just past Mitchell, where thankfully, after some heavier rain a while ago, uh, it is uh, somewhat dry right now. I'll check back in with, in with you live at 6 o'clock, then the full report on the cleanup from this heavy storm that we saw early this morning on the Nightbeat on Kelloland News at 10. Reporting just west of Mitchell, near exit 325, Dan Centella, Kelloland News.